Emily Thompson stands as a beacon of compassion and commitment, navigating the bustling world of a city clinic with a heart full of empathy and hands skilled in patient care. Each patient she encounters is not a mere chart to her, but a personal narrative, a life waiting to be healed and heard. As a young girl, Emily watched her mother, a doctor, lovingly heal not just the body but also the soul with her words and care. Emily wished to follow in her footsteps, her heart yearning for the revered title of a doctor. However, life presented an unexpected turn. Emily's mother was suddenly snatched away by a tragic illness, leaving behind a void that echoed in every corner of their home and hearts. Emily's father, crippled in a car accident, now needed her to be his pillar of strength. In the face of these tumultuous circumstances, Emily made the difficult decision to abandon her dream of attending medical school, opting instead to become a nurse. It was a career that would follow her to continue her mother's legacy of healing and also care for her father. Emily dived into the world of nursing with an unflinching dedication. While she battled her own grief, she found solace in easing the pain of others, each patient reflecting the strength she saw in her mother. Her journey through the corridors of the clinic was fraught with challenges, long shifts, scarce resources, and patients battling for life. Emily stood at the forefront, her resolve unwavering. The scrubs and stethoscope were her armor as she walked into battles every day, touching lives and making a difference. At home, she shouldered the responsibilities of her father's care, her heart aching but her spirit unbroken. However, the dream to become a doctor never quite left Emily. It lingered at the back of her mind, flaring up each time she had to step back and let the doctors take over. She wanted to do more for her patients, to delve deeper into their cases, and contribute more substantially to their healing journeys. Thus, Emily embarked on the challenging path of chasing her original dream while juggling her demanding life. Through online courses and night classes, she began to pursue her medical degree, her will fueled by the dream that never died, and the promise that she made to her mother. It was a journey filled with long nights and early mornings, brimming with the harsh reality of tests, practicals, and balancing her career. But Emily forged ahead, her spirit steadfast and unwavering. Emily Thompson's journey is one of resilience and perseverance, fueled by love and loss. Her daily encounters as a nurse and the immense love for her father push her to strive harder each day. Amid the chaos and challenges of a city clinic and the bittersweet pursuit of her dream, Emily continues to stand tall, embodying the spirit of her mother and forging a path to a future where she is not just Nurse Emily but also Dr. Thompson. Life was far from gentle with Emily Thompson as she navigated her way through the demanding corridors of the city clinic. Her compassionate care for her patients often brought her face to face with the fragility of life, a stark reminder of her father's declining health. At home, Emily's once robust father was now a shadow of his former self. His once strong grip, now frail and tremulous, seemed a harsh contrast to the hearty laughs they once shared. Each day seemed to carry him farther away from her, his features paling, his voice growing softer. It was as if he was drifting on an invisible current, and all Emily could do was watch from the shore. His doctors suggested a life-saving surgery that held the promise of better days, yet it came with a hefty price tag that hung like a gloom-filled cloud over their lives. Despite her nursing salary and long hours, the numbers on the hospital bill seemed to expand with each passing day. The gap between Emily's financial abilities and her father's medical needs seemed to grow into an insurmountable mountain, casting a shadow on her determination. Work was no reprieve either. David Johnson, a surgeon at the clinic, showed an alarming level of negligence in his duties. Emily's days were tainted with the anguish of his careless errors and disregard for his patients. Instead of being the protector of life, he seemed to gamble with it, his carefree attitude threatening to unravel the delicate threads of trust that connected the patients to the health care system. Complicating matters, David's unprofessional advances added a sinister layer to her struggles. His intrusive presence at the clinic became a constant source of discomfort. 
The hospital corridors, which she once navigated with firm resolve, now felt like a labyrinth of awkward encounters and thinly veiled harassment. Her commitment to her patience and her dream kept her anchored, yet each day felt like a battle. Amid this storm of challenges, Emily's spirit wavered, but it did not break. The insurmountable mountain of her father's medical bills loomed large, and the shadow of David's negligence darkened her path. Yet she held on, her determination undying. She began exploring every possible avenue for financial aid, from loans to grants and even considered selling the small house she and her father called home. Her nights were no longer just filled with medical textbooks, but also filled with paperwork and desperate prayers for miracles. At the clinic, she reported David's unprofessional behavior and negligence to the hospital board, rallying her fellow nurses to do the same. She faced backlash and intimidation but stood her ground. Emily chose not to bow to fear but to rise against it, her every action a testament to her mother's legacy. Emily Thompson's struggle was an embodiment of her strength and determination. With her father's health teetering on the edge and her professional life under siege, she was being tested like never before. Yet, amid the mounting difficulties, Emily remained a beacon of hope, courage, and resilience, her heart ever filled with compassion and her unwavering in the face of the adversity. Her journey continued each day, bringing her closer to becoming Dr. Emily Thompson, a testament to perseverance in the face of unimaginable challenges. Emily Thompson was no stranger to the unexpected, but the day Donald Lewis walked into the city clinic would forever be etched in her memory. Donald, a homeless man known to the staff, shuffled through the clinic doors, his usually jovial eyes replaced with a look of desperation. He was supporting a woman, her face a pallid mask of pain, and pleading for immediate attention. But, as fate would have it, the only available surgeon that day was David Johnson. His indifference to the homeless woman's condition was all too apparent. His casual dismissal of her plight, nothing less than a chilling betrayal of the oath he had sworn. His cavalier disregard for the woman's life amplified the silence in the room. It was then that something extraordinary happened. Donald Lewis, whose life was often dismissed by society, stepped up to the monumental task. He insisted he could perform the necessary procedure, a claim that sounded ludicrous given his circumstances, but his intense gaze held a flicker of determination. David scoffed at the idea, dismissing it as a desperate ploy of a madman. But Emily, seeing the resolve in Donald's eyes and the dying woman's need for immediate care, decided to gamble on the improbable. She agreed to assist Donald, helping him don the surgeon's scrubs. As Donald stepped up to the operating table, the homeless man disappeared, replaced by a figure of immense command. His hands, so often outstretched in plea, now held the surgical instruments with expert precision. His movements were methodical and precise, mirroring the actions of a seasoned surgeon rather than a man who called the streets his home. With Emily assisting, Donald operated on the woman, his every action a testament to a deep-seated knowledge of medicine. Emily watched in awe as he navigated the complex procedure with the expertise of a seasoned surgeon. His action steady, his focus unwavering. The operating room was filled with a tense silence, only broken by the rhythmic beeping of the heart monitor and the hushed whispers of the assisting nurses. Emily couldn't help but marvel at the homeless man's surgical prowess and command of medical knowledge. She was assisting an unlicensed surgery, a fact that gnawed at the edges of her professional ethics, yet she was mesmerized by Donald's confidence and skill. The surgery was successful, and as Donald stitched the final suture, the room echoed with a collective sigh of relief. The critically ill patient was stabilized, her life no longer hanging in the balance. The miracle they had hoped for had come from the most unlikely of sources. That day, Emily witnessed a paradox. In a room filled with trained medical professionals, it was a homeless man who held the scalpel, saving a life that others had dismissed. The clinic that day was the stage for an unlikely hero, and Emily Thompson, a spectator and participant in this exceptional act. This unexpected event would shape her understanding of what it truly meant to save a life and serve as a sobering reminder 
of the depths of human compassion and capability, even in the face of societal prejudice. As the news of Donald's identity unraveled, shockwaves coursed through the clinic. Donald Lewis was not merely a homeless man who had, on a whim, decided to perform a life-saving surgery. He was a renowned surgeon whose name had once been synonymous with surgical brilliance. His tragic fall from grace was the result of a devastating family tragedy that had led to his life on the streets. The revelation sent ripples of surprise, horror, and admiration through the staff and leadership of the clinic. Emily Thompson found herself at the center of this turmoil, a beacon of unwavering support amidst the torrent of opinions and judgments. She was the nurse who had defied protocol, who had believed in Donald when no one else would. Emily's decision, once deemed reckless, now stood as a testament to her unshaken faith in human potential. But the revelations didn't end there. The patient whom Donald had saved was not just any individual. He was the son of the city's mayor. The news brought a political dimension to the narrative that was impossible to ignore. The mayor, who had been a vocal critic of the clinic's administration, was now inextricably linked to the institution that had saved his son's life. The political implications were seismic. The city administration could no longer ignore the clinic, especially when its management was under scrutiny for David Johnson's negligence and indifference. The media latched onto the story. Throwing the clinic's administration into a media whirlwind, they were ill-prepared to handle. Faced with the media onslaught and mounting political pressure, the clinic's leadership had to respond. Some rallied in support of Donald and Emily, celebrating their bravery and commitment to their Hippocratic oath. However, others took a defense stance, highlighting the dangers of unlicensed surgery and the potential legal repercussions. Emily found herself thrust into the spotlight, her actions dissected by public opinion, and the clinic's leadership. The once humble nurse was now a public figure, her life turned upside down in the wake of the controversy. Amid the chaos, Emily remained grounded, fortified by the knowledge that her actions had saved a life. Yet she found herself grappling with the new uncertainties. Was her support for Donald justified, despite the possible legal implications? How would the clinic's administration react? and what would happen to Donald now that his past was laid bare. Donald's story was a stark reminder that life was full of unexpected twists and turns. The man she had known as a cheerful, homeless regular had turned out to be a former surgeon, a master of his craft brought low by life's cruel hand. This revelation, coupled with the political storm it had sparked, had transformed Emily's world. The quiet rhythm of her life as a nurse had been replaced by an unpredictable tempo, fueled by controversy, politics, and the very human story of Donald Lewis. As the news of Donald's identity unraveled, shockwaves coursed through the clinic. Donald Lewis was not merely a homeless man who had, on a whim, decided to perform a life-saving surgery. He was a renowned surgeon whose name had once been synonymous with surgical brilliance. His tragic fall from grace was the result of a devastating family tragedy that had led to his life on the streets. The revelation sent ripples of surprise, horror, and admiration through the staff and leadership of the clinic. Emily Thompson found herself at the center of this turmoil, a beacon of unwavering support amidst the torrent of opinions and judgments. She was the nurse who had defied protocol, who had believed in Donald when no one else would. Emily's decision, once deemed reckless, now stood as a testament to her unshaken faith in human potential. But the revelations didn't end there. The patient whom Donald had saved was not just any individual. He was the son of the city's mayor. The news brought a political dimension to the narrative that was impossible to ignore. The mayor, who had been a vocal critic of the clinic's administration, was now inextricably linked to the institution that had saved his son's life. The political implications were seismic. The city administration could no longer ignore the clinic, especially when its management was under scrutiny for David Johnson's negligence and indifference. The media latched onto the story. Throwing the clinic's administration into a media whirlwind, they were ill-prepared to handle. Faced with the media onslaught and mounting political pressure, the clinic's leadership had to respond. Some rallied in support of Donald and Emily, 
celebrating their bravery and commitment to their Hippocratic oath. However, others took a defense stance, highlighting the dangers of unlicensed surgery and the potential legal repercussions. Emily found herself thrust into the spotlight, her actions dissected by public opinion and the clinic's leadership. The once humble nurse was now a public figure, her life turned upside down in the wake of the controversy. Amid the chaos, Emily remained grounded, fortified by the knowledge that her actions had saved a life. Yet she found herself grappling with the new uncertainties. Was her support for Donald justified, despite the possible legal implications? How would the clinic's administration react? And what would happen to Donald now that his past was laid bare? Donald's story was a stark reminder that life was full of unexpected twists and turns. The man she had known as a cheerful, homeless regular had turned out to be a former surgeon, a master of his craft brought low by life's cruel hand. This revelation, coupled with the political storm it had sparked, had transformed Emily's world. The quiet rhythm of her life as a nurse had been replaced by an unpredictable tempo, fueled by controversy, politics, and the very human story of Donald Lewis.